sectarianism is a disease of institutional religion and dogmatism is an enslavement of the spiritual nature. It is far better to have a religion without a church than a church without religion. The religious turmoil of the 20th century does not, in and of itself, Vatican spiritual decadence. Confusion goes before growth as well as before destruction. There is a real purpose in the socialization of religion. It is the purpose of group religious activities to dramatize the loyalties of religion, magnify the lures of truth, beauty, and goodness, foster the attractions of supreme values, enhance the service of unselfish fellowship, glorify the potentials of family life, promote religious education, provide wise counsel and spiritual guidance, and encourage group worship. And all live religions encourage human friendship, conserve morality, promote neighborhood welfare, and facilitate the spread of the essential gospel of their respective messages of eternal salvation. But as religion becomes institutionalized, its power for good is curtailed, while the possibilities for evil are greatly multiplied. The dangers of formalized religion are 1. Fixation of beliefs and crystallization of sentiments, 2. Accumulation of vested interest with increase of secularization, 3. Tendency to standardize and fossilize truth, 4. Diversion of religion from the service of God to the service of the church, 5. Inclination of leaders to become administrators instead of ministers, tendency to form sects and competitive divisions, establishment of oppressive ecclesiastical authority, 7. Creation of the aristocratic chosen people attitude, 8. Fostering of false and exaggerated ideas of sacredness, 9. The routinizing of religion and the petrification of worship, 10. Tendency to venerate the past while ignoring present demands, 11. Failure to make up-to-date interpretations of religion, 12. Entanglement with functions of secular institutions, 13. It creates the evil discrimination of religious castes, 14. It becomes an intolerant judge of orthodoxy, 15. It fails to hold the interest of adventurous youth and gradually loses the saving message of the gospel of eternal salvation. Formal religion restrains men in their personal spiritual activities instead of releasing them for heightened service as kingdom builders.